Hi guys, Chris here from Azon Kickstart 2015. Got another video for you here. I'm going to go over a few things that will help you if you're looking to get the site or your sites up and running. Still sticking with the niche selection because I want to go over the points and make sure that it's really clear before we get to Azon Kickstart 2015 and start going into more advanced stuff or at least different things that you can do. Um, I also want to tell you about a strange day I had, um, very strange, basically won't go into details because it's, it's not the nicest of subjects, but been suffering with IBS and for those of you that suffer with that you'll know how sort of frustrating that can be, it's like really weird and you go to the doctors and you say you've got a bad stomach and then they say right take these and you try it and it doesn't work and so on and so on. And it basically led all the way to the joys of a colonoscopy. So I was actually booked in yesterday for a colonoscopy. I don't recommend it as a pastime. It's not that much fun. <laughs> but saying that, um, for any of you that are sort of, um, if you ever have to do one or if you're worried about it, don't be. My experience was really good on the whole. It's not fun, um, but it yeah is is over quicker than you think and it's not as bad as you think so not to go into details about that but here's the good news all back on track i'm still doing the 30 day follow through the or the uh, 30 day case study for the for amazon and i'm going to restart that on monday i obviously had to stop that for a few days because um well for obvious reasons but i'll start that on monday and because of that, my weird day yesterday, I will, um, I've, I've put some time back on the site builder. I've increased it to seven days. Um, there are only two spots available. There's been um, one spot has been taken. There's only two spots for this service. I need to change that there from a free to a two. But do consider that if you want to get up and running because it will be the only spots I'm taking before um, Azon Kickstart 2015, which launches on the 3rd, which does seem still like quite a long way off, but it's only a week really, and it gives me time to do these orders that come in now. So do consider that if you want to get up and running, just a little bit more sort of momentum for you or motivation. Looking at my emails here, I've blotted some of it out because it's not fair on Dave to show his email address off and so on. And I showed you an email from Dave. The reason I focus on Dave is because um, he does what a lot of people don't and he's just doing it. He's just getting the sites up there. Um, here's a reply and he's put, um, no problem Chris, hope he's all okay. And that's telling him about my strange day yesterday. <laughs> and... Uh, he said, just one bit of news to show again how good your system is. I put one site up a few days ago in one of the niches I picked and sent to you and made my first sale today. And another site in one of those niches I put up has ranked on page six already. So really it is a case, and it's like what I replied to Dave, you know, kudos for doing it. Kudos for getting the sites up there and getting them out there because that's how easy it is. If you're feeling disheartened, because I understand that comes into it, that's a big part of it. If you're feeling disheartened, just get a notepad and pen. And this is, of course, if you want to focus on Amazon, but write down specifically what you've done. And I'm not saying that you haven't done anything. I'm saying this is a trick I use for myself. When you're getting disheartened, if you get a pen and paper and write down, right, what have I done? How many sites have I built? And if it's like four, five, six, seven, or even one, it doesn't matter. Just write it down. And then put how many pages of content have I added? And th this is all to get it fresh in your mind. I know it sounds like a weird sort of exercise and it won't work. But what you get is a real 90% of the time when I do this exercise myself, not just with Amazon sites, but with anything like the case studies I do and these YouTube videos, I will write down and, and actually think, what have I done? Where, where am I going with this? What have I done thus far? And it's never as much as you think. So what I'm asking you to do, whether you take advantage of the site building service or not, is really write a plan down. Um, get a pen and paper, write down and make a date. So we've got here, say we're on the 
Friday the 23rd, right down, I will have two sites up before the 30th. You know, and I know that sounds really obvious, but by doing that and sticking with that, what you want to try and get to is have such a... Initially, I recommend that you start with just the sites because you're sort of, you know, everyone starts with the money and the money will come, but you have to get the sites up and out there. The reason you want to start, of course, have money goals, but the reason you want to start specifically with setting the sites up is so you've actually got momentum. So before, if you... If your goal was, for instance, $100 a week, okay, like a bit of extra money, aim to set five sites up as quickly as possible. Set your own date and how long it will take you, but just do not do anything else online marketing-wise until you set those five sites up. And I will give you a free appraisal once you set up your first site. If you want me to look over any site and give you a sort of nod and say, yes, that's fine, send me an email to cljpublishing at gmail.com. With this site building service, I will do everything for you and you will get 10 sites. 10 sites, 7 pages a site and a 1,000 words per page. I've also been asked, can you do any less than 10 sites? If you're interested in this service but you don't want 10 sites and you want 5, send me an email to cljpublishing at gmail.com and I'll see what I can do with the price and a 5 site offer for you. But if you want to go for it, I recommend the 10 um, the 10 site offer just because that allows you to really hit 2015 some really good niches a good mix of low low end prices medium prices and high end prices and also a good mix of products that are really popular and products that are just about to be really popular as well so do take advantage of that I've increased the timer and you'll get all of the bonuses and you will get where have I put it you will get um, Azon Kickstart 2015 plus all of the upsells free of charge and there will be a few upsells on that so you want to get advantage, take advantage of that um, before the 3rd of February. Also, just wanted to show you really quickly, so a bit more about the niches, just going to pick a random niche here to show you, a sort of show and tell is the best way um, to teach you. Narrowing down on the niches, so say if you've just listened to what I, was, what I was saying and you want to get five sites out there, literally how you narrow down on the niche, I've shown this before but I'll just show you in a random niche, is you go to, let's see, Home Garden Tools and click on that. Then move across here, let's go for something weird, Patio, Lawn and Garden or something a bit different. So you go there and then on the left you want to look here or down here. OK, um, I tend to look on the left because you could just see right here. Now what you can do is just, again, we're looking for a niche. So let me have a look. Um, got pool supplies, they'll be quite good coming into the spring. You just look through. You're not really looking with any, like, trying to spot a niche at the minute. You're just looking through at the different categories, grills and outdoor cooking. So you could do that, grills and outdoor cooking. Um, grills and there we go and this is the key this is the key part I want you to get from this video and how you pick a niche you then get the grills and these are the new and popular as it says here sort by new and popular F really good any of these you could build a site but what you want to do is go to the Google AdWords keyword tool and further narrow down so you've got built-in grills freestanding grills tabletop grills so if we if we go down to freestanding grills then it brings up all the freestanding grills obviously but you want to make sure on your site initially make sure there's searches for freestanding grills you don't have to target the URL or the domain name to freestanding grills if you don't want to unless it's got loads of searches you just put best barbecue grills or something to that effect but what you do want to do when, when you're writing your content is tell them best freestanding grill so you'd have like you'd have five products from here and two pages targeting freestanding grills keywords and then you expand the site by then focusing on go back to grills tabletop grills 
You see what I mean? That could be a totally new section of your site. And what happens is when you've got freestanding grills, tabletop grills on the menu across the top, and you, you go and you put your cursor on it and you can see all the grills, um, you'll get ranked and you'll get sales fairly quickly. Because these sort of, we're getting ranked on the products, but you also get picked up on these sort of weird phrases, tabletop grills, freestanding grills. And that's just an example. I hope that makes sense. I have also got something else for you over the weekend. Just a quick niche selection action plan. It's only going to be a short PDF of a quick description of each step. So you can print it out and stick it on the wall, put it on your computer desk, and it will help you when picking a niche. If you want to take advantage of the site builder, click the button below and um, you'll go straight through to this page. I'm fully out of being sedated now, so I'm all, um, all ready to start on the site straight away. The case study, as I say, will start properly from Monday, just continuing with the 30-day plan. Just as a side note, the sedation was pretty weird. It was... Um, it was like being awake and asleep at the same time, if that makes sense. And I thought I was awake. And as I was being wheeled out, I think I sort of was chatting gibberish to the, the nurse that was wheeling me out. And I thought it sounded OK in my, in my head, but I could hear myself slurring. So it was really, really strange. Let me know if you've been through that experience. Um, send me an email, cljpublishing at gmail.com. And don't worry about it if you ever have to. It's... Um, Oh, and of course, the main thing, or the thing, it was all clear, which is obviously brilliant, because I was, um, yeah, a, li a little bit worried, sort of, been going on with sort of stomach upset. Nothing major, but it had been going on so long that you end up thinking, what, what's this? And that's what happened. So if you're in the same position, I recommend that you go for it and get that done. If you're in the, I know it's different in the States, if you're watching from the States and you pay for all your health care and so on. But if you're worried about it, um, get it done because it does give you huge peace of mind. Anyway, all ready to start on sites. Um, put your order in. Only two spots, so I'm changing that. It says three spots. Only two spots, seven days left. If you want a spot on this as well, be quick because this is going to go live in other places like Facebook and the Warrior Forum um, advertising. So... I want to fill these spots before Azon Kickstart 2015. They won't last long. So two spots left, guys. I'd love to build the sites for you and get you some sales in. You've seen the email, how easy it is. I hope the niche selection made sense. Let me know if you've got any questions. Let me know if you want me to check over your sites. And let's go for it in 2015. Cheers, guys.